Hi guys, good day. Welcome to my channel, Chop and Carb. Today, I will show you on how a root crop turns into a beautiful flower. So, let's do it. First step. Peel the turnip so it is easy for us to input our desired design. Guys, kailangan talaga natin tanggalin ang kanyang balat dahil po sobrang tigas nito. For the next step, we have to divide this turnip into two parts. The first half is for the first flower. Guys, take note. Kung paano kayo humawak ng ball pen, dapat ganoon din kayo humawak ng knife. Then, cut the first petal and remove the flesh behind. For the second step, overlapping. Overlap, cut the second petals, then remove the flesh behind. Guys, for the third petals, cut the petals and remove the flesh behind. Then guys, uh, repeat the same process for the port petals, overlap the third petals, then cut the flesh behind. Guys, same, same process lang hanggang matapos natin ang first layer. Guys, sa pagkat ng petals, kailangan isang stroke lang para mas malinis ang dinaan na ng ating knife. To start the second layer, we have to cut the first petal in between the first layer. Gaya ng first layer, Overlap the first petal, then cut the flesh behind. Guys, waitin lang yung process hanggang matapos natin ang second layer. Guys, for the third layer, uh, same process. Start the first petal in between the second layer, then cut the flesh behind and repeat the same process until the third layer was done. Guys, kung napapansin nyo, ang pinakagit ng part natin is kukunti na lang. Ang main goal po natin dyan is maubos talaga siya hanggang sa buo natin ang desire nating flower. Guys, this is the first half of our turnip. The white rose. Tingnan nyo naman kung gaano kaganda ang ating ginawa. Guys, for the other half, we have to start our base at the bottom. As you can see, the base is not visible. To make it visible, we have to cut a flesh from inside the circle. Then start to create a small petals around the base. When you are done on the small petals, 
now you have to remove the flesh behind and make it sure that you will not damage the small petals. For the next layer, start the small petals in between the first layer and when it's done, remove the flesh behind. And for the third layer, repeat the same process until it's done. We are done for the base to make our tower more bigger and more beautiful. Now we have to start making petals outside the base. Guys, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more design. As we can see, this design is very easy. Because from the base up to the third layer until it's done is the same process. Guys, for the final touching, we have to clean and remove the exist part under the flower. Guys, lately we have one piece of thorny, but now take a look at these two beautiful flowers.